One more. Why not? Magmar versus Lionar. Why is everyone playing Magmars? Why? Huh? Why? So I could do a first turn, summoning of those both. Unless he's got a Komodo of his own. It does, doesn't it? Yeah, it's it's less economic than Faeria. Faeria has structures, and structures were a big part of what made Faeria so, so strategic, where you build an economy with those mills and the gold mines and stuff. Ah, he's got a Komodo. I cannot do my Komodo turn then. No, I can. I can summon the Komodo here, walk here. I can, I can. What you gonna do when Komodo comes for you, huh? You ain't gonna do nothing. A rock pulverizer. Well, I guess I'm gonna do the same strat except on the bottom to avoid his taunting. So I could instead use the alchemist to kill him, but um, this is just a better minion. Do I want to go aggressive? I don't want to go aggressive. Or maybe I do. He's gonna go up anyway. Um, let's keep my army close to my hero. Um, that's how that's how my faction rolls anyway. That's my, my that's how my general rolls anyway. He just surrounds himself with, with forces. Um. It's hard to say with the claws, really, because there's so much powerful stuff in this game. Maybe the claws are supposed to be powerful. Maybe they're supposed to feel borderline OP. Same as other cards from other factions. It's hard to say. And besides, it's still very early in the game. It might need a nerf. Who knows? But it might not. Maybe you just need to play around it. Maybe what needs to happen is that they can't stack, so it can't be a one-shot kill on the hero. What is this? Grow plus one and he's got two of them. Oh shit, I can kill one, but I can't kill both. Ooh, no fun, man. No fun. Crap, I need to find a way to kill him. And the alchemist doesn't have enough damage. But he might be uh, used on the next turn. Oh man, if I could rush him with a Komodo, then I could do a... Komodo Alchemist, but then next turn I'm not gonna have the... I don't have the mana, I need one more mana for that. Fuck. So I could do Komodo Alchemist. Oh yeah, I have mana, I have mana. Because this costs only one. Okay, I can do it, I can do it, I can do it. Um. Um. Can I just say I love my faction? Oh my god, this worked. Hum. Oh, he's not gonna be happy about this one. They could have grown like crazy. The interaction of your enemy is to attack with cheap minions first. That's basically the extent of the interaction with it. So yeah, 
minions are much more interactive. Oh, we're talking about second wish combo. I don't know what that is yet. Would be nice if I could turn on the stats of units permanently. Not just when I mouse over. Arebeth, Young, Silithar. And another one, that may be too many for me to deal with. I hope they're not gonna attack me yet and I can actually... Oh no, that's n I don't have the plus one, plus one on every minion buff. Not anymore. But the minion that just deals two damage to everything... I mean, the, the spell that deals two damage to everything... Might be legit. I mean, I basically just... It hurts me as much as it hurts him, but if I... Mm. It hurts him more, actually. Legitimately hurts him more. So I basically do that combo and drop a Silver Guard on him. This then I don't need. And I'd like to keep my stun for... Flexible flexibility purposes for next turn. So then this punches that and that. Yes, okay. Oh no, I can't, I can't. Fuck. Oh, but if I do this. Well, no, I didn't die. Oh no, wait, that was misplayed. That was misplayed. I was hoping to kill this Silithar. It's just gonna have to survive. Oh no, because I can't go here. Oh wow, I can actually go here and my own units are not blocking me. Brilliant then, brilliant. And then go like this. And then I can... I wipe my own units, yes. But I wipe both eggs as well. And those guys are pretty hard to remove otherwise in a situation like this. So I'm happy. And I've got a unit he doesn't, so it's a decent initiative thing. It was pretty complicated, but I got it done. A flying general? Oh my god. No, that is ridiculous. What? How did he get a flying general? Whoa, that is ridiculous. I mean, you can just fly around the entire... <laughs> Damn! Damn, flying general, man. And the claws! Of course the claws are coming in, I mean... Why wouldn't they? It is a good spell. Fuck that, though. Uh, the claws are gonna kill my 8-8 eight, eight with one hit. Unless I'm gonna get a 9-9. Nine, nine. Oh, I'm gonna get a 9-9. Nine, nine. Fuck that. No, I can't afford it. I can't afford a 9-9. Nine, nine. That was probably misplayed by me. Could have just stunned him. And now he's gonna punch me with the claws. And I'm not using a lot of my mana. Can I still replace, or... I hope I can still replace. No, oh man, yeah, I, I, that was not the best turn I ever played. The, the potion will really help against his claws, but... Honestly, I don't like what I did that turn. It was just... It was maybe more efficient if you don't count the fact that I wasted four mana. I should have just stunned that 3-3 three, three and played my gigantic golem. Probably in the back, and the next turn I could have buffed it, and then I could have attacked him with a 9-9, nine, nine, so even if his even his claws couldn't handle it. That would have been the correct turn. If I if I lose now, I think I can track it down to this turn, to be honest. Now he probably punches me with the claws, and then I could waste those claws with the alchemist, hopefully, next turn. If not, I'm in trouble. Even with my potion, I'm in trouble.
Takes no damage from the enemy general. Well, I'll have to figure out how to kill that. That seems pretty good. He's surrounding me with shit. I think I lose. I finally lose. He'd probably reach the golem? Not if I put it behind me. How would he reach it? Yeah, well played. You got me. You do got me. I can't handle this shit. I would need to top deck something pretty damn wild right now. That's it's not wild enough. Um. Um. Cause I gotta attack the hero to break the claws. Um. 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 And then kill the ranged guy. This guy's gonna be attacking me for free. Um. I drop my zeal guy. Should I go for the kill? I'm gonna go for the kill. And then stun this guy. Hopefully I will draw... Can I? Um. Hopefully I will draw an answer. Yeah, there's my answer. Two damage. I can remove him next turn. Kill Phalanx, stun Archer? I mean, kill Phalanx with my hero? Oh no, if I punch it here, I kill this with the Alchemist. But then he would still have the claws. Yeah, you forgot the claws. There you go. Yeah, I had to use the claws. So what I did was better. It's still looking okay, depending on what he has. It's still looking okay. He may not have a removal against this 8-8. Usually, his removal would look like kill the lowest attacking minion, so... Whoa, Dispel! The fucking Dispel! And he's gone! He just killed him with the Dispel, GG. GG. Juju. And now he's got the lowest attack, so you can just kill him. He figured it out. Well played, well played. You deserve this one. I, I can totally give you that one. Um. Um. So if I now attack this guy, I'm gonna have nine, seven, four, two. I'm gonna be alive. 